Verse of the Day November 10, 2022 The resurrection of the dead, what is more important to us is the belief that we will spend eternity with God and those we love, Luke chapter 20 verses 37 to 38. Devotion The resurrection of the dead You are well aware, I'm sure, of the people who ask questions that are so outside the norm that there are no answers. This was the case with the Sadducees, who asked Jesus whose wife a woman would be in heaven if she married seven brothers and was widowed by them all. This falls into the same category as how many angels would fit on the head of a pin. These questions are designed to trip us up. The Sadducees didn't believe in the resurrection, so their question was meant to trip Jesus up. It didn't. His answer, which we have above, reminds us that a belief in the resurrection goes back almost 2,000 years before Jesus was even born. We are approaching the end of the liturgical year, so we will see more readings that will encourage us to think about the end times and the second coming. One of our strongest beliefs is in an afterlife with God and the resurrection from the dead at the end of the world. In our common creed, we say that we believe in the resurrection of the body and life everlasting, as I have said, and probably will again. I don't worry so much about the end of the world as my own end, but I'm sure we all have questions about what that will be like. In our common creed, we say that we believe in the resurrection of the body and life everlasting, as I have said, and probably will again. I don't worry so much about the end of the world as my own end, but I'm sure we all have questions about what that will be like. I love to envision myself as taller, thinner, and much better looking than the reality. Actually, I really don't care. What is more important to me is the belief that I will spend eternity with God and those I love. The Sadducees are in for a surprise. Let us pray. Gracious God, you are so patient with your people. The Sadducees and the Pharisees had quite different ideas about eternity. But Jesus answered their questions, even though he must have been frustrated at times. I'm sure I frustrate you as well, and I thank for your patience with me. Amen.